The side form comes with four pieces that need to be attached to the base piece. First, peel the dub double sticky tape off the backrest and attach it to the baseboard as shown. Next, take the headrest, remove the double sticky tape, and attach it to the base next to the backrest as shown. Now, take the armrest, remove the double sticky tape, and attach the armrest next to the headrest as shown. Have your patient lay down in the form so that you can carefully see how to add the fourth piece, the side piece. Pull the double sticky tape cover off and attach with your patient as shown. Open the seven foot bag as wide as possible and pop the bag open with air. Next, slide the bag over the side form. Next, carefully remove the cap off of bottle one and pour the entire contents into bottle number two. Cap the bottle and shake vigorously with the cap pointing down inside of the form. Next, take the bottle and pour foam on top of the headrest and the handrest and inside of the form as shown. Remember, you have two sets of foaming agents to make this form. Now you're ready to pull the bag down over the rest of the form. Pull the bag all the way down and start to push the bag on top of the foam. Push it down over the headrest, the armrest, and all other areas where foam is touching the form. Try to get as much air out of the bag as possible. When you're done, pull the ends of the bag down and fold the end of the bag underneath the form so no, fo no foam will spill out. Next, have your patient climb inside of the form and lay down in a desired setup position. If you have trapped air in the bag, carefully puncture a hole away from the foam and push out as much air as possible. You can cover this with tape or roll the bag down and hold for 10 seconds. Go all the way around the patient while the form is setting up and make sure the patient is in the right setup position. To get your patient out of the form after 15 minutes, grab their arms and carefully guide them up and out of the form. The form will be strong and durable enough that they can sit on the form or climb out of it any way they need to. Notice how deep the impressions are to guide your patient back into position. To put your patient back into the form, have them rise up, sit on the base of the form, and carefully guide themselves back into position. You'll notice as they start to get back, they will wiggle until they're comfortably in place. Go around the patient and make sure they're in the exact desired setup position.